Hey guys, Steve from Resale Dojo back, and today I'm going to show you how to remove stickers from cases so you could sell them on eBay or other platforms. Uh, it's a very easy process, and it takes three items that I use, uh, and you can find these at any type of store. The first one you're going to want is a bottle of Goo Gone. You don't need one this big. I have one this big because I use it all the time. You want some type of wipes or spray just to clean it. And then you're going to need some paper towels. So let me show you guys how I do this. Okay, so as you know, to remove stickers, uh, it leaves a lot of residue on there. So you really want to be able to get them off as cleanly as possible. So. Uh, the longer the sticker's been on there, the more work you're going to have to do, but really it's a very easy and quick process, especially once you start to do it. The first step you want to do is take a piece of your paper towel, uh, just get it folded in half there. Step two, grab some Goo Gone. I have a spray bottle here, but some of them are pores, so I'm going to just spray a little bit here on the paper towel. Step three is going to be applying and wiping that Goo Gone onto your sticker here. Ideally, you're going to want to wait a little bit of time before you try to peel this off. Uh, the longer you wait, the easier, the less residue that will be on there. So it means less work you'll have to do afterwards. But if you want to, at the beginning, uh, peel it off, and I'm going to do that for these purposes, you can peel it off right away. The less amount of time that a sticker's been on there, the less residue it's going to be leaving. Um, as you can see, there's some residue on there. But I just use my, my fingernail to get this off. You can get a Scotty peeler um, as well. So as you can see, it is leaving a lot of residue still on there just because I did not let it sit. If you do let it sit, it pretty much all comes off, especially if it's a newer one. Now, you see the residue there, residue there on that side. Just wipe it down a little bit. As you can see, residue's gone there. Quick wipe on this side and quick wipe on that side. I just spend a little time there. There you guys go. So all the sticker is off. And the only bad part about Goo Gone is it does leave it a little bit oily, but we can fix it real quick. Next thing I want to show you is that Goo Gone can help you remove any of these marks. Uh, if someone writes on in pen, on there or Sharpie, it helps remove it. So just use that same rag that you got. See, so it came right off. Let's get this other one. Came right off. Now lastly, you wanna clean it. So just take one of your wipes that you have and you're gonna wipe it on down. Just give it a nice wipe over. Then you can dry this off with a paper towel and then it'll be good to go. Nice, clean. Your customers will be very happy that they get a nice clean box in case uh, once you send it to them. If you're doing a ton of DVDs at one time, I like to do this in batches. So I would do uh, the Goo Gone on the label, let that sit for maybe half hour to hour. It'll come right off. You'll barely have to do any post cleanup. Then do all of the wiping down and then all the drying in batches as well. And uh, it goes real quick. Once you start getting into the groove of it, you can knock out now a stack of 50 of these in an hour or so, and you're, you're good to go. All right, for more tips like this, follow my channel. I'm gonna have more on my DVD series as well coming soon. And thank you guys, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.